Now you've heard us mention Clout Score, and you're probably wondering, if you don't know already, what is Clout Score? Well, let's just go over here and show you what Clout is. If you go to clout.com, you'll notice that it's just a very simple interface where you can log in, and I'm just going to do that, sign in with Twitter here. I'm going to allow Twitter to use my Twitter, uh, Clout to use my Twitter account, and uh, I can go ahead and I can uh, tell them a little bit about myself. And what that's going to do is uh, it's basically going to tell the world who I am and how much social authority I have. Notice I only have a clout score of one because this is a brand new Twitter account. However, using WeTweetMe is going to greatly increase your clout score quickly. That number is a great way to measure your social authority online. When you have a high social authority, your Twitter account can be a powerful tool not only in getting the message out that you want heard, but also in increasing your rankings in the search engines. So clout.com we recommend you go here and get a profile quickly. It's as simple as that. Um, once once you've actually signed in with your with your account, they'll ask you a, a few things, and you can uh, you can see here here's some people who are influential right there, and uh, you can go ahead and add them if you'd like to. Um, but you can go ahead and you can move forward. And now, now I have a clout score of 10. Okay. However, clout score goes from 1 to 100, so I've got a little work to do to get my clout score up to 100. And that's where RetweetMe is going to give me a lot of power. And all of RetweetMe is based on clout score.